Hello and welcome to another vi video on Bamboo Homestead. My name is Belinda Zog and I'm going to show you three common garden pests that we have right now. And I think they're very common, they're around most of the year really, but I think in, yeah, in spring probably the most intense part. So the first problem we have at the moment is the flea beetle, I think that's what it is. It's a tiny little beetle that is really sort of jumpy. And at the moment it's destroying our eggplants. So I'm going to show you that in a second. And it's destroying also our potato plants. On the potato plants I don't really care so much because, um, yeah, they're, they're already quite big and they can survive like that. But the eggplants are quite tiny. I usually make like a solution, um, two liters of water, one teaspoon plant oil, um, one teaspoon soap. And then that usually gets rid of most of the pests and it doesn't hurt the plant or anything. With the flea beetle it was pretty, um, there were so many on there, so I got rid of a few, but every day I went out there and there was still some left. So I just got out my um, BT spray. So this is my Perithrium spray. Uh, in Australia they call it Dipple as well. It says aphids, caterpillars, ants, thrips, white fly. And yeah, for me it's mostly caterpillars I'm using it for the cabbage moth and aphids as well. It's pretty useful future I'm gonna try neem oil I think it's just that little bit maybe it's also cheaper because you get a whole bottle and you can mix it with water this one also made last quite a bit so I didn't use it straight out the bottle even though it says it I um, probably did like half that spray and half the water just to make it last a bit longer and it actually still worked no, no. it's also organic so it's not um, anything harmful for anything just spray it on in the evening so it is actually made from a daisy zeig mal will da hat nämlich auch das Käferli da abgegessen look that's ganz viel Löchli here was also the flea beetle making holes in the capsicum oh no it's actually an eggplant whoopsie day. number two is the cabbage moth which is the most annoying I think um, they're everywhere at the moment it's spring and when it's sunny they're everywhere they lay little tiny eggs on the bottom of a leaf usually um, brassicas so uh, brussels sprouts, romanesco, broccoli, cauliflower um, all the cabbages, kohlrabi they just attack them <laughs> and the mummy butterfly they're the ca a white cabbage moth with a, with a spot on top um, they just lay the eggs on there and then they hatch and tiny thousands of little caterpillars come out and they trash your whole leaf that you end up with just little sticks of your plant. <laughs> Here are these tiny little eggs on the bottom of our br uh, Brussels sprout fla um, plant. They're covered all over as you can see. And if you really want, if you don't have a big garden, you could just go and rub them off and they come off really easily. But you have to do that pretty much every day, otherwise they keep laying more on there. We've actually just started, uh, started to hit the butterflies, which I feel terrible about. But if you want food, I guess you have to kill. So no, we just no, give... No. Oh, I have a bone. I found it. I have to cook it. It's not fresh. Is it on the bean? We um, start hitting them and shush them off with a badminton racket and <laughs> we give them to the chickens so there's no waste and the chickens love them. Oh, a bean. Yeah, it's a bone. Colt. It's a tiny bone. A bolotti bean, I think it is. And yeah, the most effective is also the BT spray. to spray it on the bottom leaf and on top of the leaf of the plant and you're pretty much good for like two weeks and then you can do it again but then um, they still lay the eggs on it yeah yeah they've seen it now it's clear <laughs> and then number three um, pest from the garden at the moment is the pumpkin beetle it's an orange little tiny creature they're also quite annoying obviously the name says it already um, 
pumpkin beetle, they attack our pumpkins and cucurbits, which is like spaghetti squash we got at the moment, um, banana, can't even attack zucchini squashes. They're actually quite, quite hard to catch or control. Um, you can't spray anything on there, it doesn't really affect them. The only thing is in the morning or in at evening time, usually morning is the best, you find them on the leaf and you can squash them and if you do that every day, you get rid of them. It's long. And I think it looks like, I mean now it's evening time, but it looks like they've gone, which is good. If, it, if it's um, attacking a plant that's already this big, it's sort of fine. You have a little bit of time, you don't have to do it every day, but if you have a little tiny seedling with just two leaves or something, he can kill it very quickly. <laughs> Wow, look. Maxi and Kai have just harvested this many beans. Look how nice and purple they are. Sometimes you have pests like this where they eat all the leaves off, which is very frustrating. It must have been something bigger like a kangaroo or a, um, a deer, who knows. But yeah, very devastating, but lucky we haven't had that since ever. <laughs> So hopefully it comes back and yeah. On the same night this happened, something broke our stem of our plum. The first few plums have come up and maybe they smelt that, I don't know. Very mean. Kabukang. Yeah, don't be defeated by all those critters and stuff that wants to eat your food. It's just normal and you will get the hang of it, what it is and how to get rid of it. And yeah, your garden veggies will survive. It's just quite hard in the beginning to take it all and you're like, oh, so much time to put it all in and then something eats it. <laughs> Where are you going, Kaya? You guys must be due back for a fish trip for sure. Yeah. Hey, jetzt hast du es gebracht, eh? Grosse Zwiebeln. Zeig mal die Kamera. Was ist das? Zwiebeln. Zwiebeln, bravo! Schön grossi, hä? Dann bin ich morgen zum Nacht kochen. Wir müssen noch zuerst waschen und die Wurzeln wegnehmen. So, this was it for this week. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next week on Sunday. Bye! Ich winke! Bona. Bye YouTube! Bona! No, Bona, we shall He's eating a bean. <laughs>